Think back a year ago, could you have imagined all the events, the public health orders, the unemployment crisis, and the unbelievable number of people who were killed by COVID? Yeah, the pandemic is impacting everyone, but there are lessons in the chaos. Anchor Sasha Leninger takes a look at the financial lessons and what families are learning about financial stability moving forward. It's something many can relate to. We really had to cut a lot of corners to make sure that we had everything that we needed. Finding ways to pay bills, taking care of your family, all while in the middle of a worldwide We're pandemic. Back. Like everybody else, uh, I had to file for unemployment, had to find any resource that was out there. The Vasquez family is familiar to many of you. Their son born with a special heart, taking care of him, a 24 hour job with mom by his side. The family buckling down, not letting anyone inside their home because COVID could be deadly for Antonio Jr. <laughs> I love you. This all while dad gets furloughed in March. It really was an eye opening experience to find out uh, just how well you're living within your means. When you had to choose between electricity and Direct TV, well, we chose electricity. Cable, gone. Netflix, canceled. Every meal made at home instead of picking one up at a restaurant. It's a state of shock. What do you do? You go all the way back to square one, which for us right now is him. All this as their son had another open heart surgery in June. The family, like many around the country, having to ask for help and to look for resources. If anything like this ever happens again, I will jump on those resources immediately because once they, once they... Once they did come, every little bit helped. That's something CPA Montgomery Delavu says you should do. If you're not able to, to generate that savings right now, look for other things. He says find resources and try to have an emergency fund that would cover you for three months. This is easier said than done. If you can establish some credit, uh, credit cards, bank loan, line of credit, things like that, that's a way to um, not to satisfy that three months of of a savings plan, but that's a way to cover yourself. Another tip, work on the up and up, meaning report your income, because the more you report on your tax return, the more unemployment you qualify for. Those people that have uh, tax returns filed, uh, bank account information provided, are gonna be those that, that are able to see these benefits quicker. And lastly, he says, make sure you're connected with the government. When the government rolled out financial help during the pandemic, those who electronically filed their taxes and provided their banking information got their money much faster. Those individuals um, who either don't file or paper file and mail in their, their balance due or they have the IRS mail a check to them, uh, those benefits took longer to roll out. He says never be afraid to ask for help. That's something the Vasquez family agrees with. Is that a yummy love book? I'm Sasha Leninger, KOAT Action yeah. 7 News. Some other tips, reach out to local resources like the food banks around and school lunch programs too.